In my very first video, I showed a trick for how you can convert a standard part into a skeleton model. But let's say that you want to do the reverse. Let's say I have a skeleton model and I want to use it as a regular solid part. For example, here I am with a skeleton model and I'm using a license configuration without the advanced assembly extension. You'll notice that my model tab is pretty much all grayed out. If I select a feature and try to edit definition, I'm going to get a license error. So let's say I want to work on this as a regular standard part. Well, you can't just do a save as. If you save a skeleton under a different name, it's going to still be a skeleton. The trick that you want to do is start by creating a brand new part. I'll hit the new button. You can also use the keyboard shortcut of control N and I'm going to give this a name. I'll call this my track base model. And you want to uncheck the option for use default template. Let me click on the OK button. And instead of using one of your standard templates, you can click the browse button. And now I will go to in session. Here is that skeleton model. I will click the open button and then OK. And my new part is created using all the different features that were in that particular model. And I have all the functionality of my model tab.